iOS 11 is coming this fall and it's bringing a feature that many are calling a so-called dark mode. iOS 10 introduced an option called invert colors, which literally inverted every single color that was displayed on your iPhone. While it did turn all the white UI dark, it also inverted icons, videos, and photos, making regular use extremely distracting. This fall, iOS 11 will take it even further, bringing a new smart invert option, which excludes images, media, and some apps from color inversion. This option is leaps and bounds better than the original, offering a clean, dark UI while being able to comfortably use your device without being distracted by oddly colored media. Taking a look at a couple of the most commonly used apps, like photos, music, and the App Store, this new dark mode looks great. The previous invert colors mode even inverted the camera while taking a photo or video, a problem that has now been fixed with Smart Invert. This feature is very much still in the beta phase, with many app icons on the home screen constantly switching between regular and inverted colors. Apps including Safari and Mail still unintentionally invert media, along with all third-party apps. It is expected that Apple will fix these issues before the official release of iOS 11 by detecting all media types and excluding them from color inversion. Smart Invert isn't just meant to look cool, it could save battery life on the new iPhone 8. Because Apple's next generation flagship handset is rumored to feature an OLED display, having a largely black user interface would reduce power consumption on the screen, allowing users to get more uptime out of their device. OLED stands for Organic Light Emitting Diode, meaning that each individual pixel can produce its own light source. It works by only sending power and turning on pixels that are displaying an image. Conventional LCD displays, like the one in recent iPhones, require a backlight to illuminate the pixels, even if the image is mostly dark or even entirely black. That means LCD panels are wasting battery life, where OLED screens can conserve it. It also means that OLED displays show a more true black color than an LCD. Meanwhile, with an OLED screen, any pixel that is black is literally turned off, therefore saving your battery life while producing an amazing contrast ratio because, well, you can't get darker than a turned off pixel. This is one reason the Apple Watch comes with a darker user interface featuring black backgrounds. It saves battery life with the wearable device's OLED display. This is also the reason why recent phones like the Galaxy S8 can display the time and other information even when the screen is turned off, since it's only lighting up the small amount of pixels that are being used. With OLED technology expected in the iPhone 8, it's logical that some of these capabilities unique to OLED displays could be introduced to the iPhone lineup. For example, an always-on display could show things like the top information bar at all times. Or, an always-on virtual home button could potentially be used to detect a tap and initiate the rumored face unlock feature. There is also the possibility of Apple offering an ultra-low battery mode, where the new iPhone will switch to the smart invert dark mode along with all the other battery saving measures. Or, if you're a user that needs the absolute longest battery life, you could have smart invert enabled around the clock. If you could think of any great ideas or features that could be implemented with this awesome new OLED technology, let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, like it and hit that subscribe button. Also, check out our price guide, which makes it extremely easy to find the best deals on Apple products updated daily. Be sure to follow us on social media, and we'll see you in the next video.